Hello, hello, welcome, shalom, salam alaikum, namaste, it's your girl, when it's Monday, also known as Dr. Benny Small, your relationship therapist and coach. If this is your first time here, please and please and please kindly hit the subscribe button to see more of my videos. Thank you and nice having you in my space. Receiving rejection can be quite challenging, but it is important to handle it with grace and respect. Here are five things to consider if a woman turns you down. One, respect her decision. It is crucial to respect her decision. And not pressure or guilt trip her. Everybody have the right to make their decision in their relationship. Life is a choice. Everybody choose to live as they want. So you get to respect her decision. Two, stay calm. Make sure you keep your emotion in check. It is natural to feel disappointed and hurt. We are all humans. We all have feelings. But try not to respond in, in a negative or an aggressive manner. That is why you should keep your emotion in check. Try to balance your emotion. Those things happen. They are natural. Take your time to process your feelings privately. 3. Maintain dignity. Avoid making derogatory comments or attempting to seek revenge. How you handle rejection reflects in your character. So maintain your dignity and be mature about the situation. 4. Reflect and learn. Take this opportunity as a time for self-reflection. Consider if there are aspects in your approach or behavior that need to be improved. Use the time to improve yourself. Use the time as a chance for personal growth. Five, stay friendly if appreciated. If you had a genuine connection before and she's open to it, you might continue being friends. Only pursue this if you can truly handle it because it's not everyone that can handle friendship after a breakup. Sometimes it's not really advisable. It's better everybody goes their way. But if she calls, fine. But nothing wrong with you being friendly with someone you were once love. Only pursue this if you can truly handle being friends without any interior motives. For me, friendship after a breakup is not really a nice one, but I would say only pursue this if you can truly handle friendship without any ulterior motives. Don't ever force love. If it doesn't work for you, let it go and make sure that you remain calm. Make sure you respect our decision. Use the time for personal growth. Time to improve yourself so that you can be a better person for someone else. If this is your first time here, please kindly hit the subscribe button to see more of my videos. Thank you and nice having you in my space.